Wow, just finished watching UFC 308. Comes out to my Ave, submits Robert, Robert Whittaker with a devastating rear naked choke and actually ends up breaking his jaw. That's why Whittaker tapped out so quickly. I mean, let's go to quickly to the start of the fight. So, Kamza said he was going to go in, he was going to use his strong wrestling. I mean, he's he's just like Alex Pereira, but the opposite way around. You know Pereira's got to stand with you, but you know Kamza Chimaev is going to wrestle you and take you down. And I thought he would have good success with the wrestling. I just didn't realise it would be that successful against Robert Whittaker. Don't know if there's any other underlining things, if Whittaker had a good training camp or whatever, but comes out to my have just looked awesome. Anyway, let's get to the finish. So, with the rear naked choke, I've heard before about people having their head turned and their jaw being pulled around like that and their jaw being broke that way, but this time he was on flat on and his arms through, perfect technique, and just squeezed underneath and actually broke and knocked out some of Robert Whitaker's bottom teeth where he managed to push back and broke the jaw. Absolutely devastating. So, as well, he had that perfect positioning on the ground. I'll quickly show you. So, I just wanted to show where he had him on the back, he was nice and high up on the back. So he's nice and high up to be able to get and sink that rear naked choking. So if you imagine we're on the ground still, it's just easier for me to talk from here. He was, like I said, above him ever so slightly, with his arms fully wrapped round the back. He had his head pushed in and he was putting, squeezing his shoulders back. So you almost want to, with here, you're not just squeezing like that, you're putting everything back and in. Pushing this arm forward, pushing your head forward, sliding this arm back and squeezing and making everything tight to that position. So pushing in, squeezing everything tight with his jaw, ever so slightly stuck underneath. Oh, it's called to break. I think that's quite rare. I've not seen that done to that quite extreme. But that just shows the strength and power of Chumayev. And I personally think he deserves a title shot now. He's definitely the boogeyman of that weight division. Let me know what you think in the comments. Do you think he deserves a title shot? Do you think he's going to be the next champion? Let me know. Also, check out this playlist for the other breakdowns.